Hi, welcome to the New Wave Cooking Club. I'm Jennifer, the executive chef for New Wave Oven. We're going to do a barbecued sea scallop. Now, there's two different kinds of scallops. You have your large ones, which are the sea scallops, and then you have the little ones. Those are the bay scallops. The first thing you need to do, I actually thawed these out. Um, if you want to cook them frozen, it's okay. You just need to pat them down with a little bit of water and then put the rub on, which I'll explain later. But there's a little muscle back here, and you need to pull that off. So I've got a couple here just to show you. And it, the texture will feel different than the actual, um, it'll be harder, more fibrous. So that's how you know to get it off. Now, if your mussels, or excuse me, if your um, scallops are really, really slimy, then you need to pat them a little bit. But these are perfect. Okay, now we're going to do a rub. And I just like this. I think it, you know, it takes five seconds to throw it together, and it has the best flavor instead of using one of those um, store-bought ones. So we're going to start off with some cayenne. You can make that as spicy as you want or, you know, leave it out. But my family likes it spicy, so we're going to keep it in. Kosher salt. A little bit of flour. Black pepper. Paprika and coriander. Just, it doesn't look like that much, but you, got, you don't want to reuse this because you're going to, you know, stick the scallops in it, so you don't want to make too much of it. Okay, I've got some already done here. Just take your scallop and just blot it in there. Then what we're going to do is we're going to, these have sat there with the moisture for a little bit, so yours will get darker too. Oops, and it's okay if they fall over, you know, it's fine. Put your dome on, four minutes for thawed, five minutes for frozen. I'm going to go ahead and give it eight minutes. Uh, you do not have to flip these. If you want to, go ahead. If you don't, um, if you do flip them and want to add a little bit more seasoning, go ahead and do that. I think this is enough for me. So touch and go. Quick time, eight, start. And in eight minutes, we'll be back to show you the final product. We're back. We've got just a few more seconds on our sea scallops. But I'm going to show you, I went ahead and put some wild rice in a, in a cup. And I just want to show you what we do in the professional kitchens. We just roll the plate back over. And then you're left with a nice little timble. Put some fresh herbs on it. Our scallops are done. Now keep in mind, this is a wonderful rub, dry rub, for any type of fish. Oh, those look beautiful. Now they do, you know, sh shrink up a little bit, but they're done perfectly. Just place them around. And whenever I timble the rice, my family just thinks, oh, you know, it's just that little extra touch that they like. So there you have it. Beautiful sea scallops with the timble of rice. Maybe some fresh asparagus on the side. And you've got a nice, light, spicy summer dish.